for this Stones Bidder Championship match. Leeds already out on the field. They were led out today by their mascot, Laura Wright, who's nine years old, and she's favourite player is uh, Gary Schofield. Well, sadly, Gary not playing today, not recovered from his hamstring injury that kept him out of the game with St. Helens. And last week, side shows one change this week with the fact that Gary Mercer is not fit, so Paul Dixon comes up into the second row from substitute and Mike O'Neill comes into the side as substitute after a good display in the A-team on Friday. The other substitute is Vince Fawcett. I'll run through the teams for you. For Leeds, Alan Tate is at fullback. Jim Fallon, Kevin Iro, Carl Gibson and John Gallagher. The three quarters. Craig Guinness and Andy Gregory, the halves. Steve Malloy, James Laws and Sean Wayne. The front three with Andy Goodway, Paul Dixon, Ellery Annerley making up the pack. And Vince Fawcett and Mike O'Neill, the substitutes. And for Hull, we'll they line up with Richard Gate at fullback, Paul Eastwood. James Grant, Rob Nolan, Mike Donkin, the three quarters. Scott Gale and Ivan Enjack complete an Australian halfback coupling. Ian Marlowe, Lee Jackson, Andy Dannett, the front three. Steve McNamara, John Sharp, and Dean Busby, the rest of the pack. With Andy Dealove and Russ Walker, the substitutes. And the referee for today, Mr John Connolly of Wigan. Well, I think that uh, one of the big things today will be weather. The Leeds pack, which has been playing very well of late, can actually get to grips with the whole front three. Ian Marlowe, Andy Dannett and Lee Jackson. So who will kick off? And Leeds will be playing from left to right as you look at it. Important game this for both sides. Both sides not the best of records in this season's Stones Bay Championship. Leeds shown signs in the last two weeks that they're coming back to something like true form. going to be Paul Eastwood to kick off and very important set of six for Leeds to drive away from that try line Jim Fallon and driving the ball out there good way goes his self from that to half Andy Goodway, that's good play from Andy Goodway. Dixon. And Steve Malloy just burst through the first tackle. And that's back for Alan Tate with a kick. And Tate's kick spread downfield. Richard Gay took that really well there. And well wrapped up there by Jim Fallon. Leeds made good ground in that set of six. And offside there, Steve Malloy, a judge should be the culprit. The first penalty goes to Hull. And Paul Eastwood will kick the touch. Recently scored his 100th career try for Hull against Leeds in the Yorkshire Cup defeat. Leeds have only won here once since 1987 when Gary Schofield joined Leeds and that was last season in the John Player Trophy which is memorial basically for the injury sustained by Alan Hanley but that's all behind Leeds now and good performance today will certainly set the fans alight Dannett, that's good driving by Andy Dannett Jackson finds Ian Marlow, former Beverly Rugby Union player Andy Gregory quickly into his stride and under that ball. That's a mistake there from Hull. Sean Wayne driving through. Steve Malloy, and again, that's good running from Malloy. Gregory. Changes direction, goes himself. Finds James Laws and Laws just settling play down. No gap open there. Offside, and that's the first penalty of the game to Leeds. Dan the judge to be the culprit. So John Gallagher will uh, kick for goal. And what slight breeze it is, he is behind John Gallagher. So a chance to put Leeds in the lead.
playing about three minutes now. So perfectly straight. And that's missed, so we drop on the 20 metre line. Leeds not taking the advantage there of putting the two points on the board. Eastwood will bring that ball back and carefully select his spot, I feel, for the drop. Hanley oh, driving the ball in. Alan Tate goes himself for match in half. Passing behind the man, better play from Leeds. Gibson. Sean Wayne driving again now. Steve Malloy. James Lowe finds Diggity. Out to Hanley. Hanley taking the ball up. It's Dixon. And Nixon running into trouble there, but managing to get that ball away. Finds Tate. Tate will look to find Ido. That's good play from Leeds, Ido. Trying to step out of tackles, finds Gregory again. Tate, Leeds playing football, throwing that ball about, and takes away from the first man. And Leeds up to halfway there. So back for Andy Gregory, and Andy Gregory will put the kick in, just a little floater over the top there. And Eastwood. A good tackling there from Gibson and Gallagher. Gallagher had a good tackling game last week against St. Helens. Wrapped up uh, less quirk every time. And Marlow trying to make ground down the middle. And John Gallagher. Damn it. That's good running again from Andy Dannett. Jackson. In fact, it's Busby. Uh, Similar looking player to Lee Jackson with the bands around the head. Slight to coloured air from, and that's back to Scott Gale and Scott Gale. And Tate there having to pick that ball up. And got a good tackle over on that far side. I think that's by um, James Grant. And Gallagher just taking advantage and driving up from acting half. Yeah. Again, good play from Sean Wayne. James Lowe's, Malloy. Hey, hey, looks for the kick, that's a long ball out to Gibson, he's got Gallagher. Gibson split the defence. Good tackle there by Ivan Henjek. Gregory will put the kick in again. And straight to Richard Gay. Richard Gay running, looking for position. And a good tackle from Dixon coming in there. That's good play from Leeds. Cover defence coming across well. Marlow straightens up now, runs at good way. James Law's in at the tackle all the time. Put the tackle in each of the games he's played. Damn it. Just looking to release that ball and Law's coming in there and making sure. Sharp. Richard Gay almost through the gap there. Sharp. Bringing on Busby. So Leeds defending inside the 20, but Hull trying to make progress through Russ Walker. Jackson going himself there. It's a good run there from Lee Jackson. Good play from Jackson. And Jack. Gale and the ball coming out now. And a bad mistake there by Nolan. I'm trying to recover, but that's Costal. We'll have two man overlap there. Donkin now. And up to the last tackle. That's good running from Donkin. Making the, the yardage. Back to Hen Jack and Hen Jack to Gale. And Gale will put the kick in. Alan Tate's underneath. And Tate's got Gale's tackle there. That's good play there from Alan Tate. 
Kelly get again, runs from acting half. Malai. Sean Wayne. for Tate and Tate putting Gibson inside that's good play from Leeds again Gibson so Leeds playing adventurous attacking football this afternoon they get it and Gallagher chips over and Richard Gale pick up and collects John Gallagher as well crowd shouting for obstruction there but Gregory just probably a foot away from doing that good tackling again from Gallagher coming in from his wing Busby Good running from Dean Busby down the middle of the field. That's where the hard ground is made, the hard yardage. The man, another lad uh, who's pumped himself up on the weights. Tremendous top body weight. And Jack Gale. Gale puts a kick in. And that's going to find touch. Find touch just outside the lead 20 with the first scrum of the game. We've been playing for some 12 minutes now. 13 minutes, it's Leeds nil, Hull nil. So Gregory are working to feed the scrum. And that's out to Leeds. That's six more tackles as Gibson picks up there. Richard Gay kicking through to play the ball. That gives Leeds six more bites of the cherry. Gregory. And that's got to be a penalty there, Andy Gregory. The crowd in sense, but that certainly was above the shoulders on Andy Gregory, and I know it's difficult, Gregory, only a little man. So Gallagher kicks for touch. And that's fine's touch. Inside the pull half of the field. In Clement weather at the bowl of hard, but it's uh, finding up a bit now. Steve Malloy driving in. Well, it's fine, Sean Wayne and Wayne dragging men with him. Gregory again now, Hanley. Gregory again. The lovely long balls out there. By Jim Fallon. And Jim Fallon, the judge to have knocked on. John Connolly didn't see that, but the touch judge did. So good work there from Mr. Connolly using his touch judge. So the first hole, heading ball of the game results in Ivan Enjak bringing that ball out, Richard Gate. Ido bringing him down and Alan Hanley pushing him back there. Marlow. Nevada, straight into Dixon. Not the biggest of second row forwards. Jackson goes from acting half. Jackson hurt there and looked like he fell awkwardly on his arm. And Andy Gregory quickly on for the substitute. And Jackson looks in some pain. Looked to fall awkwardly on his arm and Andy Gregory straight away knew that the player was injured and immediately asked the referee to stop the play and call on the physio. So Leeds, good opening spell from Leeds. Well, Lee Jackson's sitting up now, and that's 
but she'd certainly looking at his elbow. He fell over there. Despite what the crowd are saying below me about uh, jaws being broken and Dixon being next, there was certainly nothing in that tackle at all. He fell awkwardly on his arm. And I think Jackson fit to carry on. And back for Scott Gale to put the kick in and that'll be downfield for either John Gallagher or Alan Tate. Alan Tate is who picks up and drives that ball out. Innes. I don't James Laws has a run from acting half. A good tackle in from McNamara and John Sharp bringing him down. Begley with the kick. Richard Gay running across the field, looking for the gap. And straight at Craig Innes and Innes bringing him down with an ankle tap. And again, a judge to be above shoulder height. John Wayne, the culprit, has caught in the referee, Mr Connolly. So Eastwood again will kick for touch. And again. Who will attack from just outside that 20 metres on? And he done it, setting himself up for a big drive there. And three Leeds players bringing him down. Half the Leeds bringing him down. Marlow. And again, good tackling this time. From Steve Malloy. Namara switching play. Scott Gale. Richard Gay. Richard Gay is well wrapped up there and leads. Plenty of men over on that side. Donkin. So Holmade ground here, 10 metres now from the Leeds line, using the short side. Fallon had touched that ball down behind his own line. He's knocked on on the line there, a difficult decision to see what's uh, referee. He's given head and ball to Leeds. And that Fallon had knocked on. <laughs> so that scums out all and Richard Gay knocking on there, and that's a mistake. The referee awarded the head and ball to Hull. And, um, and with an overlap, Richard Gay knocked on. So Gay's fit to continue now. And he shows it on me, goes himself. Dixon. Steve Malloy. Very good game this afternoon, Steve Malloy. Megiddy. And he's picking up a difficult ball well, and Innes is half break, half break there from Craig Innes. That's good play. Midway goes himself, puts Sean Wayne through the gap. Wayne's found lows, that's good play from Leeds. Up to halfway. Hanley, it's a kick in. That's a good kick because that's sending Hall scurrying back there and it's going to be Donkin to pick up over his own line, taking men on, on the outside and Iroh and Fallon just bringing him down. So Leeds so far had the best of the early play. They've certainly made ground and they've brought the tackle regularly. But always difficult to come here and get anything at all from the ball of had. John Sharp and puts the ball down, picked up by Lowe's. So Leeds and in possession with James Lowe's. And Sean Wayne. Driving in there, Wayne.
Laws will drive in again. Good way. Taking Blurp to that 10 metre zone. Hanley blessing on the ball. That's good running from Melanie Hanley. Leads in that 10 metre area now. Pressing strongly from the line. Gregory. Innis. Innis. Looks to go himself there. That's a long ball out for Gallagher. Gallagher wrong foot in the defence. Coming inside. And Gallagher brought down. So Gibson then will... We'll find Gregory, and Gregory puts a little grubber kick in. But that's safely picked up by Richard Gain. Good tackle himself from Andy Gregory. So our first uh, sign of a real Leeds attack comes to nothing. Richard Gray still looks groggy after that big hit that he had there when he was in the melee with Alan Tate. Ian Marlow. It's a good run from Ian Marlow. McNamara bumps off one tackle. So Hull now looking to drive the ball away with Andy Dannett. Up right to the last tackle, this will be for Enjack, and Enjack and Hull running it on the last tackle. It's out to Nolan. Donkin. So the turn over there, and that's good tackling from Leeds. Hanley, Gregory. Good way. Innes is Leeds moving that ball out now with John Gallagher. Gallagher coming back inside. Alan Tate. Gregory now finding Malloy. And that's a good running from Malloy. Gregory. Oh, and that's Anley through the gap. That's good play. And Anley's pushing men off now. Just couldn't see any inside him there. Good running there from Anley. Gregory again and Leeds starting to take control as Lowe puts Alan Tate on a run. Tate's got Richard Gay to beat. Hanley, that's going to be a try to lead to Hilary Hanley. The first try of the game then to Hilary Hanley. Lovely play from Alan Tate. 25 minutes gone. Lovely ball there from James Laws. Fed Alan Tate. And I think there Tate could have probably gone himself. He was running away from Richard Gay, but did the sensible thing. So the first try of the afternoon, John Gallagher kicks the goal. So six points to nil then. Leeds in the lead, and just to start, they'll have wanted here at the Boulevard. Not the best of hunting grounds for Leeds. A real Boulevard bogey. So Polish with again. Good way. A good drive out there from Andy Goodway. Alan Tate picks the ball up, goes himself from acting out back. Sean Wayne. Oh, switching the point of the attack there as Innis runs. Finds Gibson, Gibson pushing men off. And up to halfway, good play from Innis there and Gibson. Okay, finds Innis again. Shot ball inside, Dixon, Dixon's away. Steve Malloy. Oh, and good play again from Leeds, up to the last tackle. Gregory switching again, again there, that's out to Gibson. Back to Gregory. Gallagher. And covering up there is Innes. He puts up the up and under. Well taken by Richard Gay, and a good tackle from Innes as well. That was good football from both sides. Marlow coming out now, back for the drive as ever. Andy Goodwin. 
Steve Malloy bringing him down. Sharp. Oh, a rock back there by a great tackle there from Andy Goodway. Damn it. And Hull struggling to make ground there as Jackson runs from acting half, but gets his pass away. Busby. And up to the last tackle. Back for Enjack. Enjack back to Gale and Gale for the kick. And John Gallagher he had to turn there. Oh, and a lovely pass out of the tackle from Tate. Tate, that's good play from Alan Tate. Back up to halfway. Gregory finds Innes. Innes trying to put Gibson through the gap there and taking up the second attempt there, Kyle Gibson. Sean Wayne. Gregory again. Takes the ball in himself this time, Andy Gregory. Dixon. And Law's in again there. His chip is over there, that's for Richard Gay. And Gay having to. And good tackling there from Andy Goodway and John Gallagher. And Lee Jackson trying to run from acting half and leads it up quickly in numbers. And that's good play from Leeds defence. Busby. And Busby split there, he's got Alan Tate to beat. There's nobody with Busby. A big gap there to feel at acting half back. Richard Gay. Oh, and that's good play from Hull. Hull coming down the field there. Good Richard Gay. And John Sharp. Scott Gale. Oh, He's lost that ball. That went backwards to the referee. We're up to the last tackle. So what will Hull do now? Dan it will drive. Finds Marlow. Enjack. Nolan. And that's a good high kick. Offside there, Scott Gale. So that's a penalty to Leeds. Tremendous run from Dean Busby setting up position there, and Richard Gay did tremendously well carrying on. The good work, John Sharp involved, and Hull. Best spell of play from Hull. It's Gallagher kicks for touch. So Laws. Goes himself from that tin half. Good way. Steve Malloy. Look at it again. Gibson coming inside, straightening up now. Innis. Tom Nolan, and he's used to lane his past a fraction. Fuck Evan Arrow and uh, the long arm of Bob Nolan got out and knocked it down, so that'll be the first. Third leads heading ball at the scrum. So Alan Tate having to come off, and uh, Vince Fawcett coming on. And Gallagher at full back in the line. Ribonado goes himself, bumping men off. <laughs> and Laws are judged to have knocked on there. So Scrummel form with heading ball. Two men from the boulevard, just inside the leads, half of the field. Well, I don't know what Alan Tate's gone off for, but that's a sad blow to Leeds. And Jack finds Gale. 
Eastwood coming in. And the legger there, beaten by Eastwood, but sharp. That's good running from Sharp. And Jack will control things in the middle of the field with Gale. Nolan takes the tackle of Craig Innes. Busby goes from acting half again. Grant. Australian centre, James Grant. Dannett. And wrapped up there, Andy Dannett. We're up to the last tackle, so John Gallagher can expect the high ball. And Jack finds Scotty Gale. Scotty Gale bombs that up there. Picked up there by Jim Fallon for Leeds. Gallagher will go from that to now. Kevin Ido has a drive, straightens up. Malai. James Laws trying to split the defence there again, going from that half to the last tackle now. Back for Gallagher for the kick. So Richard Gay will run that ball back with purpose. And a good tackle. Eastwood running up, straightening up. And Hull are looking to bring Russ Walker on, I think, for Andy Dannett. And Marlow drives into the waiting arms of Paul Dixon and Andy Gregory. Hull choosing the short side with John Sharp. Well, that's a good tackle there from Dixon. McNamara to the last tackle again and again. I think John Gallagher can expect the high bomb. It's then Jack finds Gale. In fact, all running it on that last tackle. Oh, and if Leeds in trouble here. And Eastwood's brought down by Hanley, and that'll be the turnover. Fawcett has a drive from Acting F. Finds Innis. Innis spinning out of tackles. James Laws knocking on again there from Acting Half. Be disappointed, James Laws. And Russ Walker will come on for Andy Dennett now. Going at number 10, and Ian Marley will move up to the open side prop. Busby running there, that's good running from Busby. And Vince Fawcett across to tackle him. Walker, first touch of the ball. Former batter captain, Russ Walker. So Ian Marlow, I think, was a dummy runner there and uh, not intending to get that ball. So Andy Gregory will feed this scrum for Leeds. Innes. Trying to go through the gap. Dixon. Gregory, running across, puts Gibson through the gap there. Oh, that's good running from Gibson. Oh, that's a great run there from Carl Gibson, putting Leeds on the attack now as Hanley. Looking under, trying to go himself. Can't get the ball away, Ellery Hanley. Still looking to offload that ball. Trying to strength in the tackle, Ellery Hanley. Gregory. Couldn't really do anything with that ball except knock it into touch. <laughs> it's Andy Gregory there, that's uh, ball slipped, I think, from his hand there as he tried to pass. So coming up towards half time. Hold. 
We'll try and put points on the board before half time. Chidgate. And eventually three Leeds men bringing him down. And that gives the Leeds cover defence trying to get back. Busby driving up, running across the front. And a bad mistake there from Dean Busby and rolling that ball along the ground and Eastwood was never going to pick that up. So again, we'll scrum the game, just going through a scrappy phase at the moment. The fifth lead scrum finds Innes Gibson, looking for the run round, drop off for Iado. Malloy. And Law's in support, that's good play from Malloy. Oh, and Sean Wayne knocks on there. A lovely ball from Andy Gregory. So again, Hull have a chance to put some pressure on Leeds just coming up to half time. Sixth Hull's coming again. All and almost through there. Good tackle from Kyle Gibson. Sharp. Sharp. Brought down. Bayonis at six. Russ Walker. Marlow goes on the blind side, dummy run. McNamara. Hold just 30 metres from the lead post. And Jack finds Nolan. Nolan holding up his pass. Not a good pass for Duncan. And Duncan's brought down. We're on the last tackle, so Leeds will want to. Scotty Yale puts up the bomb. And well taken by John Gallagher. So that'll be a. A tap on the 20 there. And James Laws will find Sean Wayne. So the whole crowd having a go at Scott Gale. Malloy juggling with the ball but managing the keep hold. And Laws is well wrapped up there at acting half. Hanley. Figgery. Again, looks for the drop off. Finds Dixon and Dixon. And that was a good situation. Read there by Eastwood. Gregory kicks. Richard Gay, and he's knocked on Richard Gay. So Gregory feeds a scrum. In his Iro. Drop off there for Gallagher, and Gallagher puts Innis away. Good play there from Craig Innes. Lyro again. Trying to push me off, gets into that 20 metre area. His leads putting on the pressure now, just before half time. Lowe's finds Innes. Innes still running across field. Malloy putting Wayne through a gap there. And Pickety. Looks for the run round with Anley. It's out to Ido. Fallon, now what can Fallon do? Comes inside, he uses strength will Jim Fallon. It's up to the last tackle now. Leeds would love to score some points just before there. Oh, that's good play from Melody Anley. Great play there from Melody Anley. Kicked the ball at Duncan and just wrapped him up. So the scrum's tied at six apiece and the penalties and leads. Could go in the lead as far as the scrum statistics are concerned as Gregory gets that ball out Hanley. Just goes himself from the back of the scrum. Good way. 
The leads will look back on this and think they should have had some points just as we come up to half time. In his switching play, that's putting Dixon. Dixon can't get the ball away. Lowe's Gregory. Hanley. Oh, and Hanley there just can't get into his stride. Good tackle from Gale. And Gregory's trying to put Hanley through the gap. It's for John Gallagher for the drop. And it's there, so that one point could make all the difference as we go to the end of this game. So Hull defended well there, and uh, the drop goal, the best Leeds could get from a concerted spell of attack in the whole 20 metre area. So Paul Eastwood then will kick off. There can't be very long left now. We've been seem to have been saying that for the last 10 minutes or so. Dixon just driving in there. Fallon goes himself, matching half back. And there goes the Hooter then. With Leeds leading in at the bowler, had seven points to nil. We had a try to Ellery Hanley. The good work from Alan Tate. Converted by Gallagher on 25 minutes. That was 6 0. And then Gallagher had a drop goal. Just on half time to make it seven points to nil. And Leeds certainly going in with the deserved lead there. They've been a more adventurous side and they've played the best football. But whether the injury to Alan Tate will affect them, only the second half will tell John. Gallagher moved to full back and Vince Fawcett come on on the wing. So Leeds in, leading here at the boulevard. Seven points to nil. So John Gallagher then about to get the second half underway. Gallagher then. The long kick downfield for Busby and Leeds will look to capitalise immediately and try and get some points on this board. And Busby's away. An ankle tap there, great run there from Busby, straight from the kickoff. Leeds caught nap in there. And Jack. Inside to Nolan. So all certainly come out as all they mean business. Donkin coming inside looking for work. Marlow, that's a good drive for me and Marlow. Whole pack well fired up for this second half. Played something like 60 yards there in that set of four tackles. Oh, that's got to be crossing there from Enjack. Picked up by James Laws. So Leeds, thanks to Laws, bringing that ball away. Iro will find Sean Wayne. Gregory, good way, Innis, inside, drop off there for Gibson, and that was well read by Dean Busby. Good run again from Steve Malloy. Innis, straightening up. And losing that ball, Craig Innis, as he went through the gap there. So the first half scrums went 7-6 to Leeds and the penalties were tied at 4 all. And Hull just putting that right now. Donkin. Oh, Fallon wrapping Donkin. Donkin there slipped out of Fallon's tackle. That was good play from the youngster. Russ Walker has Hull putting a sustained spell of pressure on Leeds now. Marlow. 15 metres or so from that Leeds line and Leeds defending. Who's in the short side with Sharp, Jackson. Trying to straighten up there, Leeds Jackson, and well read by Leeds. And Jack again. Scott Gale. 
Nolan. We're up to the last tackle, so John Gallagher again can expect a high ball, I think, here. This is back for Richard Gay. And Jack knocking on there on the sixth tackle, trying to get the ball away to the overlap. So Leeds can play the ball and drive away with Kevin Iro. So did well there at the start of the second half hole. Fallon just taking it away. Malloy and Malloy slipped that time. Sean Wayne. Leeds still pinned on that 20 metre line. James Lowe's looks to find Andy Gregory. Gregory spinning, going himself there. Can't get the ball away, that's a good tackle there. From Marlow, we're up to the last tackle now. And Gregory, as usual, having something to say. Gallagher gets his kick in. Spins towards the touchline, sir, and Richard Gale. Stop that with his foot. Ross Walker finds McNamara. A good tackle from Dixon. Busby again, got some pace. Busby brought twice this afternoon. Marlow. Oh, that's a good tackle from Malloy and Lowe's in the middle of the field. And Jack now. It's Gale. It's a kick through. And that's for John Gallagher. Gallagher will come away. And Nolan chasing Gallagher and bringing him down. And Fawcett goes himself from acting half. Hanley. Good play there from Melody Hanley, taking that ball away. Lowe's finds good way, good way, straightening up. Gregory. Goes himself, Andy Gregory. Oh, well wrapped up there by Aaron and Jack. We're up to the last tackle. Gregory, great break there from the little fella. And Gallagher gets the kick in. That's again spinning towards the touchline side, but it's going to be picked up by Richard Gay. Gay straightening up, but a good tackle from Craig Innes. Interesting to see the tackle count this afternoon for Craig Innes. He's had a tremendous game, wrapping people up in the middle of the field. Eastwood. Chap. And again, good tackling from Malloy and Craig Innes. So the referee decides to give a penalty. And that'll give all respite from trying to drive the ball out there. Eastwood will kick up towards our commentary position and then Hull will have an attack just inside the lead half of the field. It's a good touch, so Hull just inside the lead half. We'll tap the ball with Lee Jackson. Knocked on there, did Jackson at the referee says that's all right. James Grant. Leeds, three minutes in the tackle, Russ Walker. Well, using that short side there and making ground, that's good play from Walker. Again, using the short side with James Grant. So that sucked the Leeds defence in over there and... Namara. And Oh, and a great tackle there from Hanley. Eastwood's inside there. Gale, Marlow, Marlow only knows one way and that's forward. It's up to the last tackle, some good tackling there from Leeds. Scott Gale. He's been awarded a try there, Scott Gale, a penalty try. Well, he wouldn't have certainly got that ball.
Well, there's got to be no doubt, but that was well covered by Leeds. But Leeds pulling themselves to blame there. That position behind the goals looked well covered. Leeds put themselves under all sorts of pressure there. And they're going to find themselves leading by just the one point now. And Gallagher had that kick well covered there and would have had to kick it dead. So Scott Gale awarded a penalty try and Leeds now with it all to do. So that'll certainly lift Hull, who've had the better of the opening exchanges in this second half. Forty-five minutes gone. He should convert, so it's seven points to six then. And Leeds, I feel, need to score very quickly if they're to get anything out of this game. Always difficult here at the Boulevard. So we lined up for a great second half. Fired up now with Nolan. And Leeds guilty of missing some tackles in the middle of the field, which led to that position being set up there on the sixth tackle. Sharp again. Marlow. And Hanley and Goodway wrapping Marlow up. And Jack. Switch your gate. And uh, wraps him up there. Donkin coming in field and wrapped up by Ido. Up to the last tackle. And Sharp, that's as good as a pass to John Gallagher. Fallon in the middle of the field looking for work. So Hull certainly fired up now and doing some good tackling. Steve Malloy tries a break. Wayne. That's over the advantage line. Good running from Sean Wayne. Gregory. Looks for the drop off. Finds Innes. Innes is away. That's out to Ido now. Can Ido use his strength? He's got three men inside him. That's out to Hanley. And Hanley's over for the infant, the referee has given a forward pass, would you believe it? <laughs> so all that work there, Leeds coming to nothing as Ali Hanley looked to put Leeds back in a five-point lead. It didn't seem a forward pass from where I was. So Leeds thwarted there and Hull win the scrum with Enjack, Scotty Gale. <laughs> Leeds forwards now, we'll have to keep Hull pinned down here. Marlow. Tremendous driver in of the ball here, Marlow. Gallagher's coming across there. And that's a try there. And then to all Eastwood, Russell in the lead. So all now in the lead, all coming there from a pass. The referee, a judge, was forward, but didn't look forward from here. So what have Leeds got to do to win at the Boulevard? Well, there looked to be absolutely nothing on when James Gant got that ball on the sixth tackle. And Eastwood just got there before Gallagher. And Leeds certainly missing Alan Tate at the back. And Alan Tate not in appearance on the Leeds bench.
Not a good pass inside from Grant, but Eastwood managed to kick the ball on. In fact, the pass from inside from Eastwood looked far more forward than the pass from uh, Iro to Hanley. So 49 minutes gone then. And Eastwood will uh, Eastwood will convert from in front of the post and that'll put leads 12 points to seven in arrears after being the best side for so long in this game. Eastwood converts. So Leeds now with it all to do. Just had a try disallowed and Leeds, the luck not going with Leeds at all this season. And Gallagher kicking off and finds John Sharp. Ian Mallow. Russ Walker. Out to Sharp again. That's a good tackle from Innes. Russ Walker having to pick up a bad ball there. We're up to the last tackle again. Back for Scott Gale. And that's out on the full. Lowe's finds Dixon now, and Dixon will drive. Leeds driving for position. 13 metres away from that line, Leeds is Malloy. Trying to blast his way through. That's good running from Steve Malloy again. Gay. Tackle by Ellery Hanley. Well, Leeds coming away with nothing again from the old line. It's Walker. So all these yards gained by all are valuable now. Ian Marlow will drive out. Matamara, good tackle again there. And a kick now from Scotty Gale. Force it will pick that and bring it back. And force it forced into touch on the first tackle. Oh, good defence there from Hull. So Hull feed the scrum. Hull standing to. Take control of the tight scrummages now. Richard Gay. That's a good run again from Richard Gay, all starting to look like they want to win this game. Busby. Marlow. And Jack will go himself, and he's well wrapped up there. Sharp. Spurs McNamara. And forward pass there to Eastwood, so it'll be a scrum. Ball going in, but again, whole opening leads up there on this side. Tremendous game as Ellery Hanley busting away from the scrum. Really 
good way. Driving in strong and a good way. John Wayne. Megadi finds Innis. Gibson goes himself. Gibson is away. Gibson. He's not going to get his pass in there. That's good tackling from all. Megadi again. Hanley. Driving down the middle of that field. Shot up to the last tackle now. Gregory will kick. Kick down to the corner. Fine touch right on the flag there, so that'll be right back to the 10 metre. It's a tremendous kick, touch finding kick from Andy Gregory, but Hull and ball at the scrum. 15 minutes or so, this second half gone, and it's Hull in the lead by the 12 points to seven after Leeds had that seven points. 10-0 half-time lead, all scoring twice in the space of four minutes after the kickoff. And Jack finds Nolan. And Marlow driving in again. He's had a great game this afternoon, Ian Marlow. Good tackling from Malloy. Sharp. Walker and Hull moving the ball. And Jack taking Gregory on, but wrapped up there eventually. McNamara. So four tackles gone. Comes to Connolly looking to keep Leeds onside. This is back for Scott Gale. Fawcett did well there, and this time Fawcett will run away from touchline. Gallagher. I had all quickly in acting half. Goes himself. Steve Malloy. A good run from Steve Malloy. Leads up to almost halfway now. Gregory will find Innis. And Innis finds Dixon. Dixon going himself there. That's out on the fall, so it'll be the turnover on the sixth tackle. So Hull bringing substitution, it's going to be Andy Dennett, I think, coming back on for Ian Marlow. <laughs> well, Marlow's had a tremendous game this afternoon. And a fresh legs on Andy Dennett. Could be just what Leeds don't want to see. Russ <laughs> Walker. And the Gregory are judged to have tackled above the shoulder. So Hull get the penalty, and Eastwood will kick and put Hull on the attack. Another try now will probably seal this game for the early birds. And Stutch leads trying to bring a substitute on Mike O'Neill, I think, for Sean Wayne will be, and they can get him on. But before that, there's a lot of work to be done here to keep all out. Andy Dennett driving. Just Walker, Hull winning 10 metres of the Leeds post. McNamara. Chigay, that's gone backwards as a referee. And all have lost ground now and leads a bit of respite from that incessant old pounding at their line. Down it. Yeah. 
Douglas Walker again. Dixon brings him down up to the last tackle, so will Hull look for the drop or will he run this ball? To run it on the last tackle, Sharp. Oh, well, he's falling again for the sucker punch there on the sixth tackle with Richard Gay. Oh, 60 minutes gone and Lee's falling again there for the inside ball on the sixth tackle. Oh, running that ball on the sixth tackle again instead of looking for the kick. And Leeds defence torn to shreds there. Sliding defence not coming across. Mike Smith on telling Null to calm down. They've got this game won. They've only got to keep playing the type of football they've done this half. He's missed that, so that's 16 points to seven then, all in the lead. Three tries to two goals, and all his second half, Melly started and leads unnecessarily brought down. Scott Gale, Coscali goes in hand to kick that ball dead. So Mike O'Neill's on for Sean Wayne. And Gallagher will kick. Richard Gay picks up. Always manages to score against Leeds, Richard Gay. And Busby's had a good game this afternoon. Young teenage prospect and now coming of age. Sharp. McNamara. He's played well, McNamara. First game back after an injury. He force it again. I mean, to run back many a mile to pick up that ball. Good tackle there by Grant and Eastwood. Gallagher goes himself from acting half. Straightening up now. Gregory finds good way. Oh, and well down there, Jim Fallon. A good run there by Fallon. Six more tackles to Leeds. Good way. I can heal now. Steve Malloy. Hanley. Looking to get rid of that ball. Up to the last tackle leads, not really able to get away from their own quarter. They get he chips over, that's for Ellery Hanley, but Richard Gale get there. Back to him. Eastwood get in there. As Hanley kicked on as Richard Gay got down on the field. Nolan just Taking some work off his forwards as he brings that ball up towards that Leeds defensive line, Andy Dennett. McNamara. To the last tackle and Hull have certainly had the ascendancy in this second half. Fawcett driving that ball in. Gallagher again, Leeds losing ground. And Leeds can't get out of this. I don't finds Fallon. And Fallon with space running down the touchline side. He'll take men on on the outside, takes Enjak on. Great tackle from Ivan Enjak on Jim Fallon.
Negeri, Mike O'Neill, Dixon, Gallagher in the line, Gallagher going his cell, finds Fawcett, back inside for Gibson, Lee's pissing strongly here, good way, and Hanley's going to score, and he's going to score under the post, Lee Hanley. So great football there from Leeds. So good work there from John Gallagher. The ball came across and Leeds playing football. John Gallagher converts. Leeds 13 16 down. Can they score again and pinch this game at the death? A mistake there from the kickoff by Leeds. So Leeds have to drop out now and hold a look. Duncan coming in field. Busby. from Lee Jackson there. So Eastwood then. Takes his time Eastwood and Converts this, it's over as far as Leeds are concerned. And that's done. <laughs> 22 points to 13 then. All in the lead. Trying to drive through and wrapped up by Kevin Aero. And straight at Mike O'Neill. So Hull have done a lot of running from acting half back this afternoon and made ground all the time. Busby, that's good tackling. Let them out it. Gale for the kick and Gale puts that kick down field and again that's. Back for Fawcett or Gallagher, and it'll be John Gallagher that picks it up. And Gallagher well brought down. Fawcett. Good way. Leeds have worked their way back up to the 20 metre line. Innis, Ido, stepping, coming back inside, Ido. And well wrapped up there. Oh, it's going from acting half back. And Gallagher kicks, and that's going to find touch right on halfway. So they hold, head and ball. And Hull worked tremendously hard in this second half. Leeds falling a bit for the sucker punch. Two or three soft tries. And Jack feeding the scrum. Eastwood trying to break through Gallagher's tackle. James Grant, that's a good tackle from Ido.
A knock on there from Jackson. It's Gibson on a run down the middle of the field. There's a big gap there for Carl Gibson, carved out by Innes. Malloy taking that ball up. It's a ball down as Dixon drives in. Shot ball for good way. The leads now, pressing strongly. Gregory, calls himself under Gregory. That's a try there to Paul Dixon. Beautiful ball from Andy Gregory to Dixon. For 22 points to 13 down. It's Gallagher settling it down. And that's successful. So can Leeds get something out of this game. Three points difference. Two penalties took Leeds down there and a great ball from Andy Gregory. Put Paul Dixon over. This time, Andy Goodway safely taking that ball. Ayado. Through there, Innis. Figgity. Find Steve Malloy. Malloy. And that's another penalty. Taking a quick tap. Playing the whole half of the field now as Leeds pressing strongly. It's a ball out there to Innes. Drop off there is for Ayro and Ayro finds Mike O'Neill. Gallagher. Surrender possession there, Paul Dixon through his legs. Busby. And tackling again from Goodway. McNamara. Mara gets the man of the match award as Jackson goes from acting half. <laughs> 15 metres from the line now. Oh, we'll all go for the drop goal. Gale. Gale. It's a kick in. Gallagher. Gallagher, will he get out from behind his own line? It's tackled behind his own line, so Leeds have to drop that ball out. So oh, this is not what Leeds want at this stage of the game. They need to be pushing strongly on the whole line, but all tackling like Tigers. All can be bottom of the league, the worst team in the country, but when Leeds come here, they certainly put it up. And well taken there by Duncan. There's done nothing wrong at Duncan this afternoon. The youngster. Jackson goes again from acting half. And a knock on there. So the scrum will form ahead and ball the lead. Finds in East Nairo. It's 
through there, and that's a lovely ball out to Gibson Gallagher. Innis. And another knock on there. So it just Leeds trying to play catch up football in the nine minutes of this game. There goes a hooter. So Leeds again, the Boulevard Boogie. Not lead again today as Leeds lose by 19 points to 22 after being in the lead at half time 7 0. So, what can I say about this second half? 7 0 half time the Leeds. A penalty tried to Gale, and there was no need for anything. Gallagher had it well covered. And 45 minutes set the ball rolling. Eastwood had a try after the look after Ellie had a try disallowed. Converted by Eastwood, it was 12 7 0. The lead they were never going to lose. A game, try to reach a game, and it's 16 7 as Leeds were caught napping on the sixth tackle. And leads it back with a try from Manley. Gallagher converted it was 13 16. And then all again straight from the kickoff. Six tackle again, Lee Jackson going from acting half. Eastwood converted, 22-30, it looked all over, but Leeds came back strongly with a try to Dixon after good work from Gregory. And it was 